lifestyle. Learn about the benefits and start now. Eating from the vine and feeling divine. Fruit living with nature's design. Here with Harry from Harry Runs. <laughs> And uh, where are we right now, man? Uh, CMU track, so trying my university track. Um, yeah, just done a solid workout, good run, good session. <laughs> solid workout. We just did like a, a max effort 5K. Harry was pacing me in the front. He was still working hard, but uh, you're probably at like 80, 85 percent. Yeah, yeah, definitely a bit more in attack, man. 80, 85 percent. Uh, probably 75 percent. <laughs> I was at like 90, 95 percent. I just I couldn't pull 100 percent out of myself, but we were close, close. Mm. Um, and. Yeah, we, we did 5k, I got 17.13, Harry probably like 17.10, and uh, it was quite a bit faster than last week. Last week Harry ran like an 18 minute 5k with, with Irwin, and I ran a 17.30, so it took uh, 17 seconds off the 5k time, that's pretty cool. Fastest time of 2016 for me. Um, more to come, man, there's more to come for sure. Yeah, we hope so, definitely, definitely, definitely. Get more in the tank, always get more in the tank, hashtag more in the tank. Um, so Harry, a couple questions for you. First, how long have you been running? Uh, I've been running over 10 years, so probably started, well, probably maybe like 13 years now. So I started when I was about 12, 13, oh. and uh, yeah, I just started off middle distance, track running, did that for nearly... What, what does that mean, middle distance? Middle distance, so um, I kind of specified in 800 meters, 1500, and then obviously cross country in the off season. Um, so really sharp, sharp, fast, hard stuff. A uh, lot of lactic acid sessions, lots of, lots of kind of uh, drilling yourself into the ground week after week after week, and... Um, yeah, now just doing a lot more of the marathons, a lot more of the trail, a lot of the mountain yeah. stuff. It's not quite as fast and intense, but still pretty fun and uh, pretty hard as well. And you find that that speed, that short speed, the short course speed, it carries over to the long course? Totally. I'm completely 100% like feel so lucky when it comes to race day or preparing for any kind of race. Because <clears throat> I still race things from 5k upwards. And um, that speed that's kind of like built in, all that hammering as a... You know, growing up, it's kind of just still in my body. So Beautiful. if I'm not touching that kind of speed and training for a while, uh, I can kind of call on it when I need it. You know, Beautiful. give me a month of good sessions, and it kind of feels like it's still there. Not quite as sharp as it used to be, but I'm very happy and very fortunate to still have it there in the tank for sure. And what what is it about running that you love so much? Like some people, when they think running, they just think, oh, hard work. I hate yeah, running. Yeah, yeah. Um, just the freedom, just absolute freedom. You got no. Kind of, you know, riding a bike is obviously similar, but you know, you've know always got something mechanical beneath your legs. Running is just so natural, so free. Okay. And um, for me, it's just always been the best way when I've been traveling or when I'm in a new place or just with friends. It's just a great way to have fun. Just go for a trail run up the mountain. It's just an obvious, you know, an obvious adventure on your doorstep. You can always explore past where everyone else goes, you know, past the city itself and just explore, you know, the countryside, the mountains, the hills. And uh, yeah, it's just a solid workout just built into your body that you can do anywhere you want to go. Just easy to take around with you. And do you find that you use running almost like a way of getting high? Totally, you just yeah. Just go and get high on running? Let's say you can obviously go hard, go, you know, physically go high on the mountains or whatever and have that feeling inside that you just, yeah, just can't replicate anywhere else. Or, you know, even just going out nice and easy, just mm -hmm. get a nice kind of meditation, free time, thinking, just clear everything up in your head and just, yeah. the world just seems like an easier place to have to run. <laughs> Definitely, I feel medicated after a long run. Totally, I feel medicated. Like I don't feel normal after a run. Mm. I feel medicated for sure. Yeah, Is, do you yeah. have any tips for people to get into that flow, into that zone when they're running? Yeah, totally, into that flow and zone. Harry is the best runner I've ever run with in my life, and I've been running for almost my whole life. You know, ever since I was three, four years old, I've been running, playing soccer, running around cross country, things like that. So, um, I've never come across a better runner than Harry. So if there's one person I would hire for a coach, it would definitely be Harry. Um, Cheers, man. So yeah, check out harryruns.com. I'll post the uh, harryruns.com, yeah? Yeah, totally, man. Yeah. And I'll post his YouTube in the description below. But uh, anyways, man, thanks for the thanks for the podcast. Cheers, man. Yeah, good. Always that good was fun excellent. To with you. And um, hey, yeah, guys, if you want any other uh, videos on any other topics, comment down below, and I'll uh, be sure to make them. Peace, guys. Happy Cheers. running, guys. Subscribe.